The state's largest transit system is unveiling a new line of buses. Indigo expects that will help with air quality, especially on these no zone action days. As WRTV's Rafael Sanchez reports, these E-Gen Flex electric buses made by Allison Transmission, they were rolled out last night under a lot of fanfare on the circle. The markings say watch your step, but watch out for these new buses now coming to Indianapolis neighborhoods. So what's the big deal? It's just a bus. It is our goal, it is our mission to reduce the amount of emissions that we are putting into the air. So this is another step in that direction. We've done it with our all electric buses on the red line. We're doing it with our all electric buses we've already ordered for the purple line. The technology lets the bus switch from diesel to electric depending on the air quality of the neighborhood. The technology that enables the bus to, to go from electric to conventional is all done through geofencing technology. Zero emissions when it's in that engine off mode, which means cleaner air. Hang on tight. The bus can go on electric for 10 miles or up to 50 minutes. You can sustain your route throughout the day without the need to coming back to the depot to plug in and recharge. It's all self-contained. Stop for a second. This bus does need diesel and the battery does not need to be plugged in. At least three buses will be deployed throughout Indianapolis at some point. Working for you in Indianapolis, Rafael Sanchez, WRTV. The routes the buses will serve have not been picked, but more than likely will be areas with air quality issues. And by the way, the red line and the pending purple and blue lines are, fuel, are full battery electric transit lines. And when all done, they have a fleet of about 100 buses.